Hello everyone, this is Captain MKG here. Thank you so much for joining me for another fun-filled, packed, action-packed day, oops, shit, of, uh, <laughs> of Let's Play Funness in Subsistence Land. Of course, I am your host, Captain MKG. Thank you so much for joining me as always. And as you remember last time, we got a lot of stuff done, but that doesn't exclude us from getting more of our work done. Most importantly, we did get a bunch of sinew, which is great for us, because we are going to need to go ahead and start crafting out... I need more cotton and cloth. That's the one big thing, is I need more cloth. And, oh, hello, Kel. So today's mission, aside from, you know, as always, trying to survive the onslaught of the deadly hunters, is going to be to go ahead and crack out some more ore, because that's, well, quite frankly, that's been a, you know, a mixed blessing in the sense of, yes, we have a lot of it, but some bitch if we can't use it all. So before we go, okay, fire is good. Let's get at her. All right, so once again, we're going to try and focus on killing level three critters, if at all possible. And let's see here. No ores up here. Oh shit, I forgot about them. Oh, you little bastards. Don't make me have to come and take you guys out, because so help me balls, I will. Ah, oh, well, so I've learned the hard way, apparently, the elks don't pack as much of a wallop as I was hoping they would. So, mostly it's moose and the coo- or, yeah, moose and the cougars that we need to fo I need to focus on killing. In order to make sure I have enough resources to keep me alive. And oh game, you are tempting me. Why was I afraid to go over there last time? Oh yeah, that's right, because there was four of those bastards. That's okay. If they want to, you know, have fun, they're certainly welcome to try to come and say hello. Which reminds me, I'm going to have to, now that I'm working on this, I'm going to have to make another pick and get those resources. I think that was cordage, timber, and good. Oops, wrong one. Just make a few quick log jumps here, try and get some more, more resources to get us in that good position of crafting up another, lock, another pickaxe. I know I'm gonna need it, as always, or as usual. Let's make sure... Yep, perfect. Aw, oh, fuck me. Leave me alone, bear. Leave me alone. Because I know you're not level 3, you're just a level 1. Oh, son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I'm just making enemies all, all around today. Oh, balls. And there's level three. One that I actually want to kill. Since I'm not hearing them. Sweet. Alright. Time for the kill. Really? God damn it. Come on down. Come on down. Damn it. Missed one. He jumped just the last second there and I missed it. Son of a bitch. No cloth either. That's the worst. Now if I'm lucky, which I'm not usually, I was hoping... Oh! Luck is mine. I found the arrow. Lucky, lucky, lucky me. Alright, so we should have enough cordage. Start popping stuff off here, and then I think I need one more tree, and I should have enough to go ahead and craft another backup pickaxe. Provided, of course, the hunters don't do a little run around on me and decide to come pay my base a visit while I'm not there. Because we all know they love to do that. Planks. Cordage. Damn, I need one more quarters and I need one more piece of scrap, too. Ooh, 
excuse me. Oh, could you be the answer to my problems? Yes, you can. Well, at least the big problem anyway. Gotcha. It's always nice just to do some extra target practice, just to make sure you don't get too rusty. get into over there. Let's see, one last plank. Cool beans. Uh, hey, how about not the bear? Ooh. You'll do. Now remember, lesson learned. Do not, I repeat, do not under any circumstances take on a critter when you're in the water. It doesn't go well for you. I know, I've been there, I've seen the death, and I would rather not have to face that death again. I do like getting some extra shotgun shells just to be on the safe side. And as you may recall from last time, now that I'm thinking about it, we also I also managed to craft a um, the breaching mechanism for the doors. So when we do encounter the hunters again, Oh my balls! Thank you, game! You're being sweet on me today, game. You know that? You just are. Bless you for it, too. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we can grab here. Okay. Just gotta make sure we can grab... Sweet, we can grab everything. Oh, lucky me. And a moose to boot. Huh? Alright, well, much like with the cougar. Damn, missed it. Son of a bitch. Well, it's time to do some moose hunting. Because you know me and how much I love my sinew. Here's the rest of the hunters. Question is, can I get around the bear? One wants to say yes. And that yes is a firm. Ooh, and the moose is back. Baby, come back to me. Let's dance, pretty. Oh, oh, man. Taking down a moose without getting hit? What even is this? Hmm? Oh, no. What was that? Oh, balls. Well, obviously, I'm taking the sinew. That's a given. Uh, let's see. What else can I eat? I suppose I'll eat that. Sweet. Oh man, game, you are just too kind. But don't let me stop you there, just keep on doing what you keep on doing. Wow, okay. We're barely 10 minutes into the game and already we've achieved quite a bit. What a great start. I feel like I feel like this might be a good episode. Better than I had anticipated. Man. Such great, great timing on the game's part. Come on, there you go, buddy. Yeah. Oh man. Cook it up, my friends. Cook it up. We are feasting tonight. Can you tell I'm excited? I mean, just the sinew alone was worth the trip. Well, let's go ahead and restock the gun. Put our seeds away, because we don't need those right now. Excellent. Oh, hey! Guess what? You're back to work, buddy. Back to work. and put that good stuff in here. Oh wait, actually, I'm gonna need some of it. 
because one can't go back out unless one has another lockpick. Aw, oh, really? Okay. Fine, be that way. I guess I'll go ahead and craft up my backup pick then. Okay, reloading. Reloading. Alright, so the shotgun's definitely going to need to have... Oh. There you go, shoddy. Have one on me. There we go. Uh-oh. I hear him. Maybe I was wrong. Maybe that was the bears. Son of a bitch. Okay. It definitely sounds like somebody's running around out there. Um, oh yeah, I need some planks. Backup fuel. And we'll just drop the rest of this stuff off in here for now. Just so we can keep some good practicing going on here. And you should be four. Let's just check. I'm gonna hang around here for a second until I get my mass up and running. How do you do, neighbor? You missed me, by the way. And all right, Drop that off. Check on stuff up here real fast. Make sure no one's trying to get the drop on me. Doesn't look like it, so that's a good start. I could have sworn I heard footsteps out here. In all likelihood, it was probably the bear. That's a crate up there. Oh, there's that son of a bitch. Ah, I was right. I am hearing them because they're close to the base. That's why. They don't want to come pay a visit. What a bore. Alright, speaking of bore, this is almost over. While we're here, I need 10. Just so we have a backup at the ready. Okay. Let's cram some food in my gut. Excellent. Always enjoy being topped up. Take you. Take one of you. I'll drop you in there once I get my pick. Should be. Come on. You say you're at 75, but you're not really, are you? There goes the ores. I should replace those. Come on. There you go. Alright, power is still looking good. Drop that stuff. Yeah, 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 that was me. It's never the hunters. Alright, have a brick. Keep that fat alive. Alright, let's see what we got to work with today. Nothing. Nobody's coming up from the sides. That's good. Great work. Alright. So now we have some cloth to work with. And damn it, son of a bitch, I got cocky. That's what I get. I got cocky again. Alright, well. No rest for us. We have to get our butts in gear. Oh, you little bastard chicken. I should chop you with my axe. But I'm not going to. Not today. I'm just going to wait for our hunters to come down and play. So I really, it's like shaking a hornet's nest with them. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. And based on my lucks of average, I have been losing mostly. So let's not, you know, increase their odds of getting a good hit on me. I will, however, come up here and grab some scrap, and then run away. Possibly to tick off the bear. Nope. Ha ha! Sure you are, bear. 
Oh, not that bear, though. That bear is very much aware. That bear is aware. Ooh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Yeah, little guy. I know. I know. It sucks. Life is a pain in the ass. Then you get sniped. Wasn't there a crate around here? There it is. It's like I'm pretty confident there was there was a crate. Okay. Onward. Let's see here. Nothing. Nothing but a bear. God damn it. Oh, there was a fire over there. Alright, well, I guess we're swimming a little bit to avoid the bear. I really don't want to tick him off, but I do want to see if I can search for some clams. Once again, going down to the Mario world. <laughs> Alright, clams, clams. No. Although doing this makes me really wish I had scuba gear. So I go down to the caves. And catch some stuff from down there. But I can't get everything I want at the moment. However, I will grab some more kelp. Because it never hurts. Oh, you son of a bitch. I am not going to risk dying in the water again just to get some pearls. I just don't have... I really just don't want to go back. Here's the thing. So if I die down there grabbing those pearls, eventually I have to go try and get back to them. Which I can't do because I don't have the right gear and I can't hold my breath up. So. Oh, excuse me. So, as much as I'd love to go down there and try my luck, I, it's much saner to wait on the side of caution. As it is when venturing up in these in these parts of the woods. You just never know who could be around the corner. Well, now that I think about it, I don't think the rogues are necessarily around here quite yet. Oh, son of a bitch. I just realized as he growled at me what I did wrong. Oh, you're a level one. That's shit. So, if y'all can remember or guess what I left at the base, you might get a cookie. And that thing would be, of course, my lockpick. Because what kind of genius would I be? Yep, if I didn't take my lockpick with me. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. It's not my day, huh? Not my friggin' day already. Actually, no, it's been my day so far. That's the problem. Damn it, it's been my day and now I'm just getting too cocky about it. So we'll just go back to the regular searching for supplies and hopefully we'll run to another rabbit somewhere. Or maybe another level 3 wolf. Something, anything to give me some cloth. In desperate need of cloth. Not so much chickens, and not so much you, damn it. Shut up, okay? I hear you, you're snoring, you're grunting, you're doing all the shit, and I just don't care. Because you know what you do for me? Practically nothing. And I want to say this is two ores. Nope, I was wrong. Because, you know, again, can't be right about everything, apparently. There we go. Oh, shit. Oh, and of course the sun's going down, too. Damn it. There's a short walk in the ground, but hey. Well worth the time. Well worth it. Bear. Ooh! Hello, dear! Do you want to play? Son of a bitch.
Come on down. Come on down. Thank you. Now you've made my trip worthwhile out here. Excellent. At the very least, you didn't break my leg. Alright, now we're cooking. Well, that was worth the trip. Time to head home. And start working on crafting some of the good stuff. The good stuff I need for survival. Mostly I'm thinking about uh, repairing, or not repairing, but crafting up my new shirt to help reduce the overall damage. But first a rabbit trick, or a rabbit treat I should say. Yeah. I know. Alright. Sweet. Just rocking it today with the loot. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves. We have to make it back to the base with the loop first. Before I start patting myself on the back. Nope, that's not great. Never mind. Never mind. Ooh, wonderful little ores just all around. We'll grab this tree, we'll grab that tree, and we'll head back to the base. We should be good enough time to get. Um, everything done. Or not everything done, but, you know, just not have to worry about anything in terms of being caught out in the wilderness for the day. Alright, and... Ah. Uh, I thought I saw a rabbit up here. Nope, you're going the wrong way, bud. I can't go that way for now. I gotta head back home. I gotta think about myself. Alright, speaking of which, let's get our butts in gear and get back moving. Oh, hi, Bear. Didn't realize this was your neighborhood. I'm so sorry. Don't worry, I am out of here. So look for magical crates and ores. Which I believe thought yeah, I saw one. And just enough roguish time to spare. Oh. Well isn't that nice? It's been a long time since I've had another bottle of water. Now comes the treacherous part of trying to head home and avoiding death. But first, an ore. Uh, I just got a glimpse of their fortress. They're definitely building it. They're definitely getting up there. So I have to be really on my level. Yeah, yeah, they're definitely, they're definitely going to be a tough. Tough thing to take down solo, that's for certain. I don't know if the game factors in for that, but we'll unfortunately probably have to find that out the hard way when it comes time to take him down. And again with the damn bear. Let's see if I can't run up towards the hunters and away from him. And that sounds like a victory to me. Yeah, it's a level one. I don't want to waste my time with level one bear. Are you kidding? Yank. Oh, come on. Ooh, stamina is not regenerating as fast as it should be. I'm probably in desperate need of nutrients. So let's get back there and take care of that problem. Yes? Yes, I think so. Uh, but I need, you know, we have a little bit of time. There's always time for ores. No time for trees, though. 
can always get plenty of trees at another day. Cool beans, all right. Damn, that bear just doesn't want to leave, ever. Damn you, level one bear. Make me take the long way around. Bear not come over here, too. Come on. There you go. Yeah, 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 you missed an opportunity for some mauling. That's your fault, not mine. All right. Okay, not too terrible of a day. Certainly not going to complain about this. That stuff done. All right, cover your ears, everyone. And cover them again. All right, now that everybody's ears are covered, <laughs> let's go ahead and drop off the important gear. All right. Drop off some more. And, oh, there's nothing else that needs to go in there. Put this stuff in the fridge for the moment. Drop off my goods. Alright, excellent. I do enjoy having that backup cloth. So it just doesn't go there. Enjoy some fat on me. eat too many of those apples. I do like having them as a reserve, just to be safe. Now, presumably, they're definitely going to be coming up tonight. Okay, so while we're doing that, let's turn these out. Get this back in. Excuse me. Alright, so we need a new shirt. For that, I need five padded cloths. Okay. I only have one padded cloth, so in order to make padded cloth, I need. Uh... Alright, well, I guess the shirt's not going to get made today. I have to keep that stuff for some backup. Uh, supplies here in the sense of bandages. I don't know why that bullet's in there, but you can go back in here. Okay, I didn't put any sinew in there. Uh, if I need sinew to repair that. So, yeah. Oh, good. All the fat's been rendered out. Get that. Come on. Let's go ahead and pop these three on the grill then. You. And let's go ahead and put four in. Let's put five in this one. Put four in here. And ooh, you can get the rest. Alright, crank it on. Crank it on and get to work. Power my base. Give me the power I need to live. Now I have a lockpick. Lucky me, I didn't go out, you know, and run into um, a lock crate of all things. Okay, let's split. Okay. No other ores in here to process. All the water's topped up. Okay, only one spare chicken to put in there. Surprisingly, we're actually on top of things today. Or tonight. Interesting. Another little moonlight stroll. Now, those are good. I don't need to replenish any of that for right now. Oh, they moved. Well, let's take some time. Oh, we have it. Let's do some quick fishing. Have the time to burn. No 
it will allow me to keep an extra eye on those roguish bastards over there. Which reminds me, one's there. Oh, son of a bitch. I wasn't paying attention. That's what I get. One's out there. Okay. Let's try this again. Here, little fish. I know you like bait. Come on now. It's good bait. Top quality bait. They're in the open. Oh, Jesus. There is four of them. Balls. That might take a little while to get over there and take care of them. Depending on who decides to come around the corner and, you know, pay me a visit, too. It would be nice to get their supplies, though. And if I do get killed, I'm not too far away to try and take revenge. So there is that opportunity as well. So there's a good chance I can come out of that ahead. In terms of, uh, whatchamacallit, trying to get an advantage on the hot, on the rogue hunters over there. So we'll see what we can do. You know, you gotta keep things lively, you gotta keep things entertaining a little bit. I mean, come on, the rogue hunters are always a good little just diversion to keep things interesting. Oh, little tiny one. That's okay. I'm good with little tiny ones. Yeah, yeah. The other one's gonna go off here in a second, too. Just keep the power coming. Ooh. That's weird. Anybody else notice that? The lighting just suddenly shifted. Probably it's because the sunlight is coming out now. And it's a little bit warmer. It's just weird how the light just kind of shifted like that. Hello, little fish. Don't worry, rogues. I'm a coming for you. I'm a coming for you. Don't you fret now. It's probably me who should be fretting. Okay. Oh, what a crappy. Crappy, crappy strike. Sun comes up, I go for the kill. Assuming, of course, no one else decides to do it. That way I'll try and slim down your numbers a teensy little bit. Oh shit, shit, didn't want to do that. Sons of bitches! Damn it. Son of a bitch. That is not exactly how I wanted all that shit to go down. God damn it. They had to catch me off guard. 
Maybe I should have brought that with me. Damn it. Not much to say, because I feel like a bit of an idiot. So, hooray for that, I guess. Really? Again? Bastards. Bit of an idiot, but I'll take it. Where's your friend? Come on out. Where'd he go? Oh, you're swimming away. Who else? Damn, you guys did a number on this wall. You guys good? Okay, because guess what? I'm pissed. You sons of hordes. Now that I know that you two have come down here, let's kind of give this, uh, breaching unit a test. I think I've earned a test for this. Alright. Oh, balls. Oh, that's right, I can't repair it either because I don't have the hammer. Son of a bitch. Do your thing. And drop those off. Actually, I'm gonna take one. And I don't have enough for that either. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Alright. That'll work too. Balls. Looks like I am going to have to craft the hammer when I come back. Alright. What am I missing? I will take the backup gun. Just be on the safe side. I'll take an extra bullet while I'm at it. Alright. Let's give this breaching unit a shot, shall we? I say as I stroll over directly into the wolf's path. Okay, let me see. Wolf there. Rabbit. Trying to see if I can see any activity over there. Wait, that's a double negative. See if I can see? Yes, of course I can freaking see. Jesus. can't get that rabbit, it's too close to the bear. So presumably, I killed two of the hunters over here. Which means there are two more hunters at the very least over at this base now. So now it's just a matter of getting close enough to take them both down. At the very least, taking one down. God, Jesus, I don't have time for you today, dude. I really don't. Oh, shut up, the Bothia. I don't know where the other one is, but I'll get him eventually. Alright, let's see if we can't do some sniping then. And... Okay, he's given up. He's not interested. 